Hi, this is Larry Jordan. This is an excerpt of a recent power-up webinar entitled Animation and Keyframes in Final Cut Pro 10. In this excerpt, I want to show you how we can modify the animation in the custom title to create some very interesting visual effects. But if you want something that gives you the maximum flexibility for animation, let's go to another title. This is called the custom title. We'll do a search down here, drag over. The custom title gives us a wealth of opportunities for animation. Select the clip, drag the word title up here, double click it, great blue heron. Select it, go to the text tab, change this to Herculaneum because it's a cool looking face. Change the point size to 125 point. Just drag it so it suits. But look at what we can do with the title. Look at all the different in parameters and equally look at all the out parameters. What this does is this shows how our text is going to end. I have to add a drop shadow. You can't put text on the screen without a drop shadow. So I just had to go back and turn it on. This is where our effect is going to end. This is the conclusion of the effect. By grabbing these in sliders, I want it to fade up from black. And I want to have it animate by character or character without including spaces or word or line or everything. Let's have it animate by word. I want it to scale up. I want it to be really, really small and get bigger. I want to have it rotate 180 degrees. And I want to have it um, slide in. So we've added all this animation. Look at what happens. First, it's really small. Second, it's really faded out. The characters are rotating. They're getting bigger and bigger. Look at that. So what I'm doing by adjusting these sliders is I am manipulating the animation associated with this clip without ever using keyframes. Same thing at the end. If I want to have this gradually slide apart, let's just have it spread out and we'll gradually have it fade to black. So now watch what happens. It just disappears. That's the benefit of animation. What we can do is that we can have all these parameters, whether it's a simple build in, build out, or with the custom clip, we have complete control over the kinds of movements that our letters provide. The good news is animation is easy. It's a switch. The bad news is we don't have the precision or the control or the exact parameters that we want to be able to play with that we would work with if we worked with keyframes. This has been an excerpt of a recent Power Up webinar on animation and keyframes inside Final Cut Pro 10. For the complete version of this online training, please visit our store at larryjordan.biz slash store and look for Webinar 105. Thanks. If you need to stretch your training dollars, a subscription membership to our video training library saves you money. You can access all of our videos for one low monthly price of only $19.99. More than 600 movies, dozens of hours of training, all in-depth and up-to-date. Plus, members can attend any of our Power Up webinars for free. Our training covers both Apple and Adobe software. We update it every week. And for more information, visit LarryJordan.biz slash subscriptions.